Well, this is what we're hoping to produce. A nice little batch of nice thick asparagus. And this is what we're going to use. We've got a packet of seed and we've sown them up in, a, in a trays and transplanted them into these pots. Now they are growing. So we're going to put them out. This bed has been well prepared. The soil was dug out. Um, seaweed was put in the bottom and any compost that I might have had from my plastic compost bins that was put on over the top uh, and mixed with the soil. Um, a bit of sand was also mixed in with it um, and this is the result of this is our bed all ready to go. Left for a while to settle down. Right, now a little bit of blood fish and bone. So I'm going to sprinkle a bit of um, blood fish and bone to each hole and then mix, mix it into the soil. Yeah, that should do it. Now I might keep one pot and put it uh, and, and keep it in the green ace or keep it separate. So, um, yeah, I'll keep a pot, a little pot, because I can then pot that one on. Because it's all a bit of an experiment to see which is the best way. Um, comparing this with the roots that I've just done. So, now then, I'll tuck them all in. And hopefully... They'll be cosy and in time they will be slightly ridged um, but for the minute all we're, happy, all we're worried about is making them happy. Now because we've used blood fish and bone um, we will need to cover because obviously that's going to attract creatures like cats and foxes so we need to cover. Now I believe the soil pH needs to be six, six and a half, six point five. So I'm going to add some coffee grounds um, in the hope that that will um, alter the pH just that little bit. Even though my steady light, uh, my steady light, even though my plot that I've already got, uh, that is neutral and it's been fine all the time. We've got a bit of rain forecast today. It's now August the 15th and these look successful. They've got new shoots. As you can see there, see that's an actual nice new shoot there and the same there. We've got the same with this one. Yeah, all the way through. Growing them in pots from seed is there there's a better chance of having success rather than dig up a root. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> 